It's been eight years since the earthquake and tsunami which changed the lives of so many people here. Daisuke Onoe's home was destroyed that day, and while he finds it difficult to put it behind him, there's one moment he clings to. The emperor and empress came in. He walked over to where I was, knelt down and said, it must have been difficult for you. I will never forget his words. The 83-year-old says meeting the imperial couple in an evacuation center gave him the strength to rebuild his life. Akihito's compassionate response to the disaster became one of the defining moments of his reign. For those affected by this terrible tragedy, I feel deeply pained. Akihito succeeded his father, Hirohito, in 1989 and spent much of his reign trying to address the legacy of Japan's actions in World War II. But the emperor holds no political power and he's stepping down as the prime minister wants to revise Japan's pacifist constitution to allow for a military instead of what it calls a self-defense force. It's also believed that the emperor is at odds with the government over the very future of his family. The imperial family is generally regarded as fairly liberal, but it's still a male-dominated institution. Only men from the male line of the family can become emperor, and the family has no power to change that. It has to come from the government. Once Naruhito becomes emperor, there are only three men left in line. One of them is 83. There have only been female emperors from a male line in the past, and there has never been a female line emperor. We should talk about this. It may mean changing tradition, but we have to be flexible and reflect modern-day society. At 59, Naruhito is considered one of a new breed of royals and may relate to a different generation, some of whom question the relevance of the imperial family. For Japanese, such as Daisuke, the relevance is very personal. From time to time, he proudly wears the same clothing he wore when he met the emperor. I have been treasuring this cardigan. Whenever something happens, I look at the cardigan to cheer me up. Akihito retires at a time when the imperial family's popularity is high, according to opinion polls. But the transition will raise more questions about the family's future and whether more change will come to ensure it survives. Wayne Hay, Al Jazeera, Tokyo.